Hey everybody, I'm your man Dennis Pitsenbarger. We're here at PRI with Power Auto Media and my friend Kurt Urban from Skagadiki Park Center. It is so great to see you be part of the team, man. What does it feel like now being part of the great Skagadiki Park Center team? Well, yeah, I've only been here about four months so far and been building a lot of stuff and coming up with some new thoughts on what we're going to try and do with the LS and keep building on the big block Chevys that are already here and a little changes on those, making some EFI versions of that. So working forward, trying to uh, add some new products we can sell and make some cool engines. All right, Kurt, well, let's talk about those two specific applications you're going to get to play with because we all know how much fun you have forcing air into an engine. Let's talk about the turbocharging systems a little bit. Now, you can only divulge what you can divulge. But let's talk a little bit about what you got planned for some of the engines and the packages in the race shop. Well, yeah, we're starting with a couple of LS engines. One will be a street-oriented, 1,200 horsepower, twin turbo, uh, 400 cubic inch engine. Um, we believe it'll fit in a lot of different vehicles. It'll be a lot of fun. Uh, very high torque. We'll have a truck-oriented high torque driver that's one of my favorites. Um, then we have a 2,000 horsepower version we're going to work with to uh, be more race-oriented or really radical street, you know, the guys that you, you and I both know that, that use those cars for some more fun stuff, drag week type stuff. Um, still a highly durable engine, it's what we've always gone for. Um, it's what we do. The, uh, we have a carbureted big block Chevy also that we're working with that, that we're going to switch over to EFI and do a little stuff with that also to try and pick it up a little bit, give it, give it some room to grow on the fuel, more fuel to it. What's it like having the resources of Skog and Dickey behind you and that race shop to be able to kind of really let it out? We have, uh, we do have a lot of resources here and we got a lot of great guys in the race shop working with me, uh, helping me along at that. So that's been uh, kind of good to work all that out. The dyno's there, so we're going to do some testing and figure this stuff out, you know, sell good packages. Talk a little bit about being part of that race team. You know, everybody knows your reputation for being an incredible builder and really understanding the inner workings of what truly is getting air in, getting air out, and making some power along the way. Does it feel great to be part of a team that has such a focus on performance and being part of something that's so great? Yeah, we, we've got some great guys that I work with now. They're uh, very helpful and helping me move forward, and I got to try and help them move forward a little too. And um, Yeah, that's been, that's been really good. Well, you know what, Kurt, it's great to see you over at Skagandiki Parts Center in the race shop. You know what, You've, you and I have known each other for years. If I could only build engines half as good as I talk on this microphone, I'd have your job and I'd give you this. But if people want more information about what's going on over at Skagandiki and, and the race shop, where do we send them? SDParts.com. You heard the man, SDParts.com. Power Auto Media, right here, PRI. <laughs>